Hi everyone, welcome to your PDA and this is Shabha. So my this video is for all the aspirants of NHPC. Now you see whenever you're preparing for any organization, you need to prepare for its interview really well. And the interview round comprises of an HR one and the technical round two. Coming to the HR domain, I would like to guide you certain things. That HR is a real test of your personality. And under personality, it compl comprises of multiple aspects. Now you see whenever you're coming for any interview, you have to do a proper research of that organization because that is a test that how much passionate you are to join that organization. Second important thing is that when you are coming to that interview, what about your personality, about your communication skills, about your fear, the anxiety you hold or some kind of you can say the generic HR questions that comprises of your SWOT analysis, hobbies and other your key interest areas. The third important category is the case studies round that comprises of the attitudinal issues or kind of you can say behavioral questions that suppose there is a conflict in the organization are you a team leader can you just prove it out that when was the last time you led a team and what are the important aspects you just try to monetize so there are multiple domains in hr and in this video i'm going to discuss the most important hr questions that can come in your uh, this interview also you can have the assess of the complete documentation of NHPC where all the essentials are already been listed go to the panel download the documentation and have a good reading of it because most of the answers you can just streamline from that documentation and about this particular this documentation where I'm comprising of all the important aspects of the HR round that is coming with subcategories or from where the HR questions can actually evolve and what are the most important HR questions this is the second important documentation and this is also there already there on the panel so just go to the panel go to the downloads and have the assess of all the documentation if you are just preparing for NHPC now let's get started with the most important thing that is where all this documentation important essentials are there so please just download the documentation about the generic HR question like the very first is starting with your uh, this is your introduction that how you need to introduce yourself that is something really important because many a times I see that students try to provide some extra details which is not at all required in your introduction so try to prepare your introduction in a proper manner it can be in the ascending direction it can be in the descending one whatever you are doing right now and how you're going to end it out this is something very important and do not go it more than uh, beyond one minute that is very very important second is why do you want to join NHPC what do you know about its projects and operations? Now, this is something that you are in the interview, you introduction to the interview, you want to come to NHPC, you have visited the NHPC ki site, ko visit kiya hai, important projects, kya chal rahe, humare, recent news, so these are all questions, which are very basic questions hai, and this is something every student must prepare. Next is how do you handle stressful situations and deadline? You have worked in a team, you have faced a challenge, face kiya hai, to you tell us about it. Where do you see it for 5 years? Why do we hire you? About your hobbies, about your strengths and weaknesses, about the latest development in the engineering field, all these things are something really important. Coming to the second category is some of the situational questions. That is putting you in some kind of a situation and asking you how would you manage in that. Like suppose, uh, any time you have done a previous job, you have faced a previous challenge, you have done a previous challenge, you have done a handle, you have done a previous challenge, 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 you have done a previous so just can you prove it out how had you uh, you can say kitne logo ko aapne manage kiya tha kya kya aapne uh, cheeze require ki thi jab aapne ek team ko lead karna tha all these things are important uh, what would you do if your project deadline is nearing but your team is not cooperating give us an example when you had quickly to adapt to a new situation so this is something that are just uh, situational questions that is just testing you to brainstorm yourself uh, in a right direction and what kind of an innovative ideas you can actually involve don't forget they're just testing your genuinity so do not try to fake your answers you have to be real in your answers but yes take time take a moment and then only give your answers the third important aspect is the leadership and decision making questions that is related to basically uh, if you have mentioned that yes you have evolved as a leader so Tell us about the decision making when you have incomplete information. 
when was the last time when you're working under pressure if you were leading a team and a junior engineer made a costly mistake how would you handle it how would you ensure that your decisions are fair and benefit both the company and your team lead to the conflict resolution and the teamwork what would you do if a colleague disagrees with your approach or on a project describe a time when you are trying to mediate like suppose it is conflict resolution a student do mentions that i have problem solving skills so yes there is a conflict between your subordinates you have to try to streamline them you have to try that this uh, this uh, uh, fight between them does not uh, you can say hamper the work of the office so what would you do in that condition so these are the problem solving questions which comes now you see these questions are basically what kind of a words you are going to use in your introduction the spots you are going to mention the strengths you are going to mention so choose your strengths wisely and justify them every question in hr just evolves from whatever word you are saying and that you will see in the hr rounds which uh, in hr snaps when we are actually testing you out it is nothing that hr is a fixed round of questions it is evolving through your personality whatever you say you give a question on the boost next is how do you ensure effective collaboration in diverse uh, this environments how would you have you ever faced a disagreement with your senior how you are going to handle it out then it is based on the ethical and integrity based questions right so when it is based on ethical that is have you ever faced an ethical dilemma how would you handle it out the senior is there he is violating some kind of a policies you have to compromise safety standards to meet deadlines how would you respond in that condition how would you ensure transparency and uh, this honesty aapke ethical ethics kya hai jo aap ethics mein believe karte hain what is what are the work ethics for you in which you believe or in on what principles do you work so you have to justify those also another important domain then as adaptability yes to do us if the uh, candidate is very suitable for them they try to ask them are you okay to uh, because it's going to be a job location is going to be remote you are coming from a city background are you ready to adjust in a different environment what about your adaptability skills and what about the language and the food barrier so the question must be the answer must be yes you are ready to adjust obviously and yes about the language barriers google translator is a very innovative option go for the google translators and that is going to help you out are you comfortable working in remote locations how do you handle stress and pressure working in a pressure for long hours uh, if you ever travel transfer to new department how you are going to adapt yourself what about the fast changing environment how you are going to cope how do you handle the criticism and feedback then about the nhpc and the psu work culture like it is always one question many students say that i want to serve my country and that is why i want to join nhpc but don't you think that being working in a private company also you can work or you can say you are going to serve your country only so there are some counter questions if you answer like this or i want a good work life balance i want a job stability again a big no if you are planning this for uh, why you want to join nhpc or why psu sector so you have to justify psu versus private why in all the psus you are choosing nhpc suppose in future you get a good opportunity from a maharatna would you leave nhpc and go for that these are some very important hr questions so yes why are you joining nhpc instead of a private company uh, what do you know about nhpc's organizational structures work cultures how do you plan to contribute in nhpc's uh, this growth right and sustainability efforts aapko nhpc ke csr activities ke bare mein pata hai jisme aap interested hain then it is about the career goals and growth to aap ke career goals kahan hain aap apne aap ko 5 saal baad kahan dekhte hain aapka long term kya hai mission kya hai vision kya hai you see this answer is basically testing that how long are you planning to work with nhpc don't forget they want an employee who is working for them for a long time they don't want a candidate who is just running in who is just shifting the jobs this questions actually test your loyalty prepare answers on that basis so basically what are your long term career aspirations nhpc mein aapko kaise fit in hote ho relocation ke bare mein aap apne plans ko like how do you plan to upskill yourself while working in nhpc agar aap bolte ho ki i'm looking for a progressive promotional career so do you know what are the promotional stakes why when is going to be your next promotion in promotion in nhpc so you should be aware, aware about the hierarchical structure also next important domain is based on work ethics discipline and responsibility so yes how do you ensure discipline and punctuality in your work have you ever made a mistake at work how do you rectify it 
what do you do if you realize that your supervisor's instructors are instructions are incorrect aap criticism ko kaise handle karenge from seniors can you describe an experience where you had to take the responsibility for a failed task then it is yes about the hydropower projects and industry knowledge to aapko nhpc ke major projects ke bare mein pata hona chahiye how do uh, hydropower projects contribute to india's energy sector that you should be aware about next is what are the biggest challenges nhpc faces in hydropower generation do you have any knowledge of renewable energy resources nhpc is working on how do you contribute to nhpc's mission of sustainable energy again in modern domain now these are the subset of questions which is coming from the civil engineering related hr questions how do you ensure a project that stays within a budget aapko kya motivate kar raha hai ki aap hydropower sector mein enter kar rahe hain क्वालिटी इश्योरेंस कैसे करेंगे सिविल इंजीनियरिंग प्रोजेक्ट से रिलेटेड की फैक्टर्स क्या है जब आप भी कोई भी डैम को डिजाइन करते हैं क्या क्या आप की फैक्टर्स को अपने माइंड में रखते हैं इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग रिलेटेड आपने कभी सडन फेलियर नोटिस किया हो इलेक्ट्रिकल सिस्टम में कैसे ट्रबल शूट करेंगे उसको कोई सिचुएशन बताइए जब आपको बहुत ज्यादा टाइट डेडलाइंस में काम करना था हाउ वुड यू इंश्योर सेफ्टी वाइल वर्किंग विद द हाई वोल्टेज इलेक्ट्रिकल इक्विपमेंट अपडेटेड कैसे रहते हैं न्यू ट्रेंड्स जो इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग में आते हैं uh how what would you do if there is a power failure at hydroelectric plant so means they are testing your domains now again for ec ones how do you handle troubleshooting communication system failures aap uh, experience bataiye in working with the uh, control and automation systems real time embedded systems before and how was your experience agar aapne usme kaam kiya hai koi project bataiye where you have worked both in software and hardware components how do you ensure cyber security and critical power control systems basically and towards for the mechanical engineering too what is your approach to use mechanical wear and tear undertaking engineering koi instance bata dijiye you have to train or guide a junior engineer koi situation bata dijiye jab aapne cross functional team ko manage kiya ho and subset of lots of questions i would say rest is there see this is just going to be a personality test the most important thing is to evolve confidence boost down your confidence the way you enter the way you communicate to them the way you sit in front of them and your facial expressions these are some of the components which do matter the most try to streamline your preparation in all the spaces and rest do attend multiple hr snaps technical snaps and then the mock sessions they are actually going to help you a lot guys so all the best keep on preparing do not forget to download the documentation documentation generic one which carries all the essentials of nhpc and this hr related documentation rest the preparation is on and you can attend the hr sessions and you are most welcome to do that all the best guys take care and have a good day keep your preparation on and take care have a good day